Hello everyone, welcome to the Earth Archives. The most popular tourist destination recently, Japan should be the number one. Many friends want to try ramen when they go to Japan. Today I will talk about the history and current development of this delicacy in Japan. Please subscribe before the show starts. If possible, please share the program with your friends. Please take care of it. In the heart of Japan, where tradition meets modernity, there exists a culinary gem that has captured the hearts and palates of millions, ramen. This beloved noodle dish, with its myriad variations, has a rich history steeped in cultural exchange and evolution. Its story begins far from the neon-lit streets of Tokyo, weaving through time and across continents, tracing back to the bustling markets of China. The tale of ramen begins in the late 19th century when Japan was emerging from centuries of isolation. The arrival of the black ships, American naval vessels that forced Japan to open its ports, ushered in an era of foreign influence. As trade expanded, so did the culinary horizons of the Japanese people. Among the first dishes to capture their curiosity was a simple noodle soup known as Nanjing noodles, brought over by Chinese immigrants. This dish, initially a curiosity for Japanese diners, was composed of hand-pulled noodles swimming in a savory broth, often flavored with chicken or pork. As we journey through the streets of Yokohama and Kobe, we find bustling Chinese communities setting up restaurants and eateries, introducing their cuisine to a curious Japanese public. It was here that ramen began to take its first steps toward becoming a staple in Japanese gastronomy. One of the earliest documented mentions of ramen in Japan can be traced back to 1884 in Hakodate, where a restaurant named Yowakan advertised Nanjing noodles on its menu, tantalizing both locals and foreign visitors alike. The turning point for ramen came in 1910 with the opening of Raikan. Tokyo's first dedicated ramen shop. This establishment served a rich soy sauce-based broth adorned with various toppings, including chashu, braised pork, fish cakes, and green onions. It was a revelation, a dish that resonated with the bustling urban environment of Tokyo, where workers sought hearty meals at affordable prices. The ramen craze was born, and its popularity began to spread like wildfire. Yet despite its newfound fame, ramen was not without its challenges. In the 1920s, Japan was on the brink of a social upheaval, with labor movements rising alongside economic struggles. During this time, ramen transformed from a mere curiosity to a beloved comfort food for the working class, offering solace in a bowl. The first ramen association in Tokyo was formed in 1928, marking a significant milestone in the recognition of ramen as a legitimate culinary genre. As we delve deeper into the history, we find ourselves in Sapporo in 1922 at a restaurant called Takeya. It was here that chef Wang Wenkai introduced a novel approach to noodle making, creating a unique ramen that would capture the attention of local university students. His noodles were elastic and chewy, a departure from the more delicate soba or udon. Wang's innovation, combined with a rich, flavorful broth, set the stage for a ramen revolution that would echo throughout Japan. But the journey of ramen was not linear. The Second World War cast a long shadow over Japan, causing food shortages and disrupting culinary traditions. Yet from the ashes of war, ramen emerged with renewed vigor. Street vendors began to peddle steaming bowls of noodles from mobile carts, bringing warmth and comfort to the weary populace. These vendors, often shouting Sheena noodles as they moved through neighborhoods, made ramen accessible to everyone, solidifying its place in the cultural fabric of post-war Japan. In the 1950s, ramen underwent another transformation this time marked by regional variations that reflected local tastes and ingredients. The advent of miso ramen in Sapporo was a game-changer, as chefs experimented with rich fermented soybean paste to create a robust flavor profile. This innovation ignited a passion for ramen that swept across the nation, 
leading to the establishment of iconic shops that would become household names. Among these pioneers was Ajinomoto Sanpei, which in 1955 introduced miso ramen to a wider audience. The dish's creamy, hearty broth was a hit, setting off a wave of ramen shops eager to replicate its success. As miso ramen flourished, the culinary landscape of Japan began to diversify, with each region boasting its own unique take on the beloved noodle dish. As the years rolled on, the ramen industry continued to evolve, with chefs experimenting boldly with flavors and techniques. In the 1960s, Yamagishi Kazuo revolutionized ramen once more by creating dipping noodles, known as tsukemen. This innovative dish featured thick, chewy noodles served alongside a concentrated dipping sauce, allowing diners to experience the flavors in a new way. His shop, Tokyo Ikebukuro Daikoku became a culinary hotspot, attracting ramen enthusiasts from all over the city. The 1980s marked a golden era for ramen, with establishments like Ipudo leading the charge in popularizing tonkotsu, pork bone, ramen. This rich, creamy broth became the stuff of legend, drawing long lines of hungry customers eager to savor its umami-laden depths. As Ipudo opened locations in New York and other major cities worldwide, ramen was officially on the global culinary map, transcending borders and cultural barriers. In the 1990s, ramen continued to thrive with the rise of Jiro-style ramen, characterized by its oversized portions and indulgent toppings, including copious amounts of pork fat and vegetables. This hearty, no-holds-barred approach appealed to the appetite of the modern diner, reinforcing ramen's reputation as a satisfying, filling meal. Returning to Guo Minyu, the late owner of Maisen in Nagoya, his contributions to ramen were significant. His creation of Taiwanese ramen reflected the adaptability of the dish, showcasing how it could evolve while still honoring its roots. Guo's ramen, distinguished by its spicy minced meat and unique blend of flavors, became a local favorite, attracting both die-hard ramen fans and casual diners alike. Guo's journey was not just about culinary innovation. It was a story of resilience, dedication, and the pursuit of happiness through food. As the ramen industry entered the 21st century, it faced new challenges and opportunities. The rise of social media transformed how people discovered and shared their culinary experiences. Ramen shops began to leverage platforms like Instagram to showcase their beautifully crafted bowls, attracting a new generation of food lovers eager to explore the vibrant world of ramen. Today, ramen continues to evolve, with chefs pushing boundaries and exploring new ingredients and flavors. From vegan ramen to fusion dishes that incorporate global influences, the possibilities are endless. Each bowl tells a story, connecting diners to the rich tapestry of history, culture and creativity that defines this iconic dish. Ramen is more than just a meal. It is a celebration of cultural exchange and culinary innovation. As we savor each bite, we honor the journey of countless chefs, immigrants and food lovers who have contributed to this ever-evolving narrative. In the heart of Japan, where culinary traditions blend seamlessly with modern innovations, ramen reigns supreme as a beloved comfort food, embodying a rich tapestry of flavors and stories. This iconic dish, a masterpiece of simplicity and complexity, has evolved into a national treasure, with each region offering its unique take creating what are known as the three great schools of ramen, shoyu, miso, and tonkotsu. As we journey through this savory landscape, we will not only explore these major styles, but also uncover the hidden gems that contribute to the ramen narrative, each with its own story, character, and devoted following. As we begin our exploration, let's first immerse ourselves in the world of shoyu ramen, the most widely recognized style hailing from the bustling streets of Tokyo. Shoyu, meaning soy sauce, forms the foundation of this savory delight. 
Imagine stepping into a modest ramen shop where the air is filled with the tantalizing aroma of rich broth simmering away. The deep umami flavors of shoyu ramen come from a delicate balance of soy sauce, chicken stock, and sometimes fish stock, resulting in a beautifully clear brown broth. Topped with tender slices of chashu, braised pork, a sprinkle of green onions, and a perfectly cooked ajitama, flavored soft-boiled egg, every bowl tells the story of generations of culinary expertise. Among the legendary establishments in the Shoyu realm, Ramen Nagi stands out. Founded in 2004, this shop has taken the ramen world by storm, known for its daring flavors and customizable options. Customers can choose from an array of toppings and broth strengths, allowing each bowl to reflect their personal preferences. The experience at Ramen Nagi is not just about the food, it's a celebration of individuality and creativity, inviting diners to participate in the culinary art of ramen making. As we journey further, we reach the northern reaches of Japan, where miso ramen emerges as a comforting beacon. Originating from Hokkaido, miso ramen showcases the hearty flavors of fermented soybean paste, creating a rich, robust broth that warms the soul. Picture a chilly evening in Sapporo, where the streets are dusted with snow and locals gather at cozy ramen shops. Here, the miso ramen is adorned with fresh vegetables, crunchy bean sprouts, and generous helpings of pork, offering a satisfying contrast of textures and flavors. Each spoonful encapsulates the warmth of community and the spirit of the region. One of the most celebrated names in miso ramen is Sumire, a revered shop nestled in the heart of Sapporo. Established in 1968, Sumire has perfected the art of miso ramen, drawing in crowds with its velvety broth that lingers on the palate. The shop's commitment to quality is evident in its handmade noodles, which perfectly complement the bold flavors of the broth. Diners often share stories over steaming bowls, bonding over the comforting embrace of this hearty dish, making every visit feel like a reunion. Moving southward, we encounter the third great school of ramen, tonkotsu, a rich and creamy delight that has taken Japan by storm. Originating from Fukuoka, tonkotsu ramen is distinguished by its milky white broth, crafted from simmered pork bones that create an incredibly deep flavor profile. The preparation is an art form, often taking hours or even days to achieve the perfect richness. Imagine sitting in a bustling izakaya, where the sound of slurping noodles fills the air as patrons dive into their bowls of tonkotsu ramen, savoring the decadence of the broth that envelops each strand of noodle. A must-visit for tonkotsu enthusiasts is Ipudo, a global phenomenon that began in Fukuoka in 1985. Renowned for its silky broth and perfectly cooked noodles, Ipudo has expanded its reach beyond Japan, captivating ramen lovers worldwide. The shop's signature Akamaru Modern, with its bold garlic oil and fragrant miso, exemplifies the marriage of tradition and innovation. Dining at Ipudo is an immersive experience where the lively atmosphere, friendly staff, and mouth-watering aromas come together to create an unforgettable journey through the world of ramen. Yet beyond these established powerhouses lie countless hidden gems, each contributing to the rich narrative of ramen culture. Consider Ramen Jinya, a charming little shop in a quiet alley, known for its unique toppings and personalized service. Here, the chef takes pride in creating limited-time offerings, showcasing seasonal ingredients that reflect the flavors of the moment. Diners flock to Ramen Jinya not only for the incredible food, but also for the sense of community and connection that permeates the space. In the seaside city of Kanazawa, Kaga Ramen offers a delightful twist on traditional ramen. This shop takes inspiration from local ingredients, infusing the broth with the essence of the sea, creating a unique flavor profile that pays homage to its coastal surroundings. The menu features inventive options like seafood-infused tonkotsu and colorful vegetable toppings, 
attracting adventurous eaters eager to explore the culinary fusion of land and sea. As we explore the diverse landscape of ramen, we cannot overlook the rising trend of fusion ramen, where chefs push the boundaries of this beloved dish by incorporating international flavors. Afuri, a pioneering establishment known for its yuzu-infused ramen, beautifully combines Japanese citrus with traditional broth, creating a refreshing twist that excites the palate. Each bowl at Afuri is a testament to the creativity and passion of the chef, who masterfully blends traditional techniques with bold modern flavors. Another exciting contender in the fusion ramen scene is Ramen Santuka, which has gained a loyal following for its unique approach to the classic dish. With locations around the world, Santuka's Shio, salt ramen, enriched with a distinctive flavor profile that balances saltiness and sweetness, exemplifies the versatility of ramen. The shop's warm, inviting ambiance makes it a favorite destination for both locals and tourists alike, all eager to experience the harmonious blend of flavors. In the age of social media, the ramen craze has exploded beyond Japan's borders, with food enthusiasts sharing their culinary experiences through captivating photographs and reviews. As ramen shops gain international acclaim, the once humble dish has evolved into a global sensation, with chefs around the world paying homage to its rich heritage while experimenting with new techniques and flavors. Each bowl serves as a bridge, connecting cultures and celebrating the universal love for good food. As we reflect on the journey through the world of ramen, it becomes clear that this dish is more than just a meal. It is a cultural phenomenon, a testament to the creativity and passion of those who dedicate their lives to crafting the perfect bowl. From the traditional schools of shoyu, miso and tonkotsu to the hidden gems and innovative fusion creations, the ramen landscape is a vibrant tapestry woven with stories of history, community and culinary artistry. In every slurp, we partake in a narrative that transcends borders, connecting us through the shared experience of savoring flavors that have stood the test of time. Whether you find yourself in a bustling ramen shop in Tokyo or a cozy nook in a distant corner of the world, the spirit of ramen invites you to indulge, explore and celebrate the rich heritage that continues to evolve one bowl at a time. As we close this chapter, let us carry with us the warmth and camaraderie that ramen inspires, reminding us that food has the incredible power to unite, nourish and delight. The journey of ramen is far from over. It is a living, breathing entity that will continue to evolve and inspire future generations, ensuring that this cherished dish remains a symbol of comfort, creativity and connection for years to come.